Hey guys, Ash here from c 4 Tech, and today in this video I'm gonna show you how to root the Samsung Galaxy Note 4. So this is applicable for a lot of variants. So the first thing you do is go into settings about device and see what your model number is. So once you've noted this down, head on over to the download section in the description. Clicking on link 3 will take you to this page. A clockwork mod based recovery page so see if your corresponding clockwork mod is available if it is go ahead download that from link 3 and uh, if it's not available then try my other alternate method for routing the Galaxy Note 4 I'll leave a link to that in the description down below as well so enough that uh, we've downloaded clockwork mod recovery the next thing you do is head on over to link 1 download Samsung keys from here Install it, make sure it's not running in the background. Link 2 will take you to Mega or there might be an alternate mirror that I've specified for this. From here you'd, we download Odin 3 v 3.09.zip and Link 4 takes you to Super SU. So download that as well. So guys, uh, routing a Galaxy Note 4 will void warranty. There's no way around it. As of now, if there is one, again, I'll let you know in the description. I'll probably end up shooting a new tutorial. But as of now, there's no way to avoid voiding your warranty. Uh, you will not lose your apps or data by following this procedure. But just to be safe, make sure you back up your apps and data. So now, once you've downloaded all four files, connect your Note 4 to the PC with a micro USB cable. Go ahead and copy update super SU onto your Note 4. Make sure you transfer this file to the internal SD card. So anyway, once you've done that, go ahead, unplug your Note 4 and turn it off. Now once your Note 4 is off, hold down volume, power and home at the same time. Alright, this would take you to the to the screen, hit volume up to continue and that would take you to the download mode. So now reconnect your Note 4 to the PC via micro USB and let's leave the Note 4 as it is and get to the PC. So right now, uh, right click on Odin and extract it. And right click Odin run as administrator. So as long as you as long as you've installed keys three properly, as long as your drivers are set up, this would turn blue. If it doesn't turn blue, make sure that uh, keys three is not running in the background. If it is, exit it, reboot, and uh, your Note four should get detected. All right. So now click on AP and select. Uh, the clockwork mod uh, .tar file that you downloaded from link 3 so just select it and click on start so this would take a few seconds to complete all right mm -hmm. now once this is done we are done with the PC part of the tutorial so we can go ahead jump back to the node 4 so as you can so as you can see the node 4 will now reboot just wait for it, give it a few seconds. Alright, once you're up, you can go ahead, disconnect the phone from the PC, plug out the micro USB cable, and then turn it off once again. Now once it's off, this time around, hold the up volume, power, and home keys at the same time. Let it go once you see Galaxy Note 4 displayed. So this would now have put you into your recovery, which we just flashed a custom recovery clockwork mod. All right, we are now in recovery. Use the volume keys to navigate the power key to select. So first select install zip, choose zip from SD card. Select update super SU. And hit yes install. All right, this would again take a few seconds to complete. All right, now go back and select reboot system now the first option there so now your note 4 will reboot so guys once you're up you might have some touch sensitivity issues if you do 
just open up the phone uh, the dialer app uh, the calibration might be off a little bit as you can notice here now hit star hash 2663 hash star hash two six six I'm sorry six three hash and now select TSP FW update general All right, enough. If you can see the touch update, the sensitivity is back fine. Star hash two three blah blah blah. Everything works. Everything works fine, and you can also see that you now have Super SU access. So that's all right. Once you open it up, just hit OK. It'll disable Knox, no thanks, and yes, you have root access on your phone. So I guess that's pretty much it guys for this quick little tutorial on how to root your Samsung Galaxy Note 4. If you run into any issues or if you have any queries, please do hit me up in the comments below or you can hit me up on Twitter. That's where I'm most active these days and I'll try to get back to you as quick as I can. So that's pretty much it. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, if you found this video useful, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. And for more videos like this, do stay subscribed. So once again, thanks a lot for watching. Till next time, this is Ash here from C4E Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.